Good morning, Facebook Live, YouTube, SoundCloud, wherever you're coming from. If you're watching this video, my bags are packed. I'm headed out. I don't even know why they give me a TV in my room. But I'm wrapping up my time here. And I'm going to switch this back around. But I want to have a memory of this last day it doesn't you know who knows what the future holds who knows what the future holds but this is what we've been working for this is what we've been looking forward to and it can happen it can happen for anybody who actually develops themselves you can do it they, they, they've never I've never seen a program where the person coming in didn't have just as much advantage as the person who's been in a year, two years, ten years. Good morning, guys. Good morning, everybody popping in here. But this this is truth. If, if a hillbilly from West Virginia can wrap this thing up, and I say that. I say hillbilly from West Virginia. I am the... I'm the least hillbilly person I know, but the the imagery is there, you know. Small town. We live in a town of 900 people, none of which are in my business. Um, one, my next closest business partner um, is Chris Rathburn in Gallopolis, Ohio, and that's 45 minutes away. And now I've got customers in Athens, Ohio, and that's 50 minutes away, 45 minutes away. So if I can build something, play it on Facebook, YouTube, it can happen to anybody. It can happen to anybody. Now, is this perfect? Is this the perfect situation to go out in? Nope. But I got I to gotta figure it out. I gotta make I gotta make it happen. I gotta make it I gotta make it real. I gotta make this my primary thing, so that this is the thing I'm focusing on all of my energy, all of my efforts. I mean, it, you can't <laughs> if your side hustle. I watched Miss uh, um, Van D. Ken, Kendra, Kendall, Kendall Van D. Uh, last night, say that uh, it was her, her. She she was quitting her side hustle, and I watched a little bit of her video, and I loved the fact that if it's your side hustle, you're you're not giving it a hundred percent. You're not giving it everything you got. If it's if it's your your hobby or your plan B, it, it's it's not it's not the thing you're focused on, and there, for some people. I know people who already are business owners and their plan A is working for them. So don't hurt yourself because in a direct sales network marketing business, MLM, whatever you want to call yours, the, the, it takes a while to earn the income, but then it flips. Like it really does flip over. You go from making, you know, $30 a month to three hundred dollars a month because of two ranks and you just bloop, bloop, there it is and then three hundred to three thousand bloop, bloop, just quick so it can happen to any of you it literally can happen so but I'll, I'll give you a preview of what it's been like for the last year the for the last year in 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 a little bit longer I want to say about three years I've traveled 80% of my career, uh, actually for the last 14 years, 80% of my year is spent in hotel rooms, away from my wife, away from my kids. Um, and if you do the math on that, my wife and I have been married for 12 years, and we actually have spent about, I don't know, three years together, two years, two and a half years together. Um I, I know, babe. I know. But we've not spent much time together because of work, because of me sitting in hotel rooms. 
I don't know what your family's life is like. I, I know that there's people out there who, who do shift work. And I grew up in a household where they, my, my dad did shift work. And you at least get to come home every day. You at least get to come home every day. Even if you have to put in overtime, you come home. You can, you know, get a home-cooked meal. You can get a hug and a kiss from your family. When you live 80% of your life in hotel rooms, on the road, this is not a life. You're, I haven't developed friendships because I've not been home. I'd love to be on a bowling league. I've never had the ability to be on a bowling league because I've never been home on a weeknight to be able to go bowling. I, I want some people are never going to understand what the, the only people who really can understand besides the people who do the jobs that I do, maybe if you're in the military and you go away for six months, I, I've been to war. I've traveled overseas multiple times. I've, I've had the experience of going and being away and being with family members who left behind their family members but if but i've done it for 14 years straight 80% travel that bag is packed i've got my shake mix ready to go i'm about to walk out the door and say goodbye to this hotel room man it's going to be crazy what I literally have two weeks until my uh, my job is up as of Monday will be uh, essentially two weeks. And then life begins. I, I had that conversation with Dale Calvert uh, Monday driving up here and I was listening to the the um, Think and Grow Rich. And and I literally called him up because I said, is this real? Is it? Is it real that a man from 35 to 40 starts the process to become the most successful he's going to be and 40 to 50 is where the magic actually happens? And if this is real, I'm living proof that it's real. Like, I literally found direct sales at 36 years old. I told the world there was no way that I was going to live past 35. I said it. I said it out loud many, many, many times. My wife hated the expression. She hated it. Literally two days after my 36th birthday, I turned 30, I'll, I'll turn 40 uh, July 29th. And on my 36th birthday, I signed up for my first network marketing business. I didn't know what I signed up for. It was three months later before I went to my first event and fell in love with the business. Events changed my life. Events absolutely changed the direction of my whole life. Some, I love events. I love them. It's like going to church for me. As a matter of fact, it's better than going to church for me. And some people are going to be really a network marketing event is better than church. And that's my, I believe it. I'm like, those people want to be there. They're there for a reason. They, they spent money, time and effort to get there. Most people go to church out of habit. Like they don't even, there's no desire to actually be there. They go because they don't want to not be seen by their neighbors and have their neighbors ask them, oh, I didn't see you at church this weekend, Bob. Where, where are you happen to be at? What, what's going on? It's like, mind your own business. <laughs> so events changed my life. Uh, events put the belief in me. They put the, the spirit of this whole thing in me. The entrepreneur spirit that I once had as a, as a child woke up because of events. Woke up. So, it's, it's crazy what can happen. What can happen to your life in four years? 
what can happen in five years? I mean, we're going into the fifth year. We're going into year five right now. I've, I've come through the first, second, and third year of making next to nothing. Next to nothing, okay? I want to tell you guys, my first year, I think I made less than, I don't know, less than $300, spent thousands going to events. My second year, I think I made like 1200 bucks total and spent probably $9,000 going to events, travel, hotels, food, uh, car rentals, uh, trips that we went on to prove things worked. I mean, thousands and thousands of dollars and made like 1200 Now, life's a little different. It's okay. It's not, it's not, it's like I said, it's not perfect yet. We ain't, we ain't having to, you know, you know, struggle and we're not, you know, uh, buying Lamborghinis. Um, I, by the way, I wouldn't, I don't think I'll ever buy a Lamborghini, even if I could. Um, and by the way, I, I drink Taco Bell water because I usually get beef, chicken, and cheese as a meal on this keto thing. So, but anyways, the, the, the whole point of all of this is if a guy who has a Facebook account, has an Instagram account, has a YouTube account, has made connections with people, take some skill that has that, that you, you learn some of you have skills that I don't have some of you can do some things that I can't do and you can use your skills to create a profit you can do things to make money your skills will pay way more than your job will ever pay your skills will pay you more than your job will ever pay and all you got to do is find something to be passionate passionate about. Find something. I mean, I watch my friends be passionate about energy patches, and I see my friends being passionate about their bags and their their e-commerce sites. And uh, I watch people chase shiny objects like like a dog, a cat chasing a laser pointer. I watch marketers go from one program to another program to another program to another program because the allure of money drives everything. Hey, let me show you my results. Let me show you my back office. Look, look what I can do that you could possibly do if you do all the stuff that I do, but I know you won't, but I'm going to show you so you can spend that $50, $20, $100, $1,000. The allure of money is ridiculous. I don't show my back office. I don't show people how much money we've made. And if I did, it wouldn't be fair. It's not fair. Don't show your back office. Don't show your results. Show your results by your lifestyle. Show how you're living because of the effort that you put in. Tell people the truth. It took me four years to get here. It took me four solid, four solid years. July 30th is my fourth year anniversary in sales, in direct sales, network marketing, whatever you want to call it. My fourth year anniversary. I joined in uh, 2014, July 30th, 2014, and this is, this is it. This is the fourth year. You can do it. You can absolutely do it, but you have to stay focused. If you change companies, your primary company, I'm not talking about affiliate marketing. I'm not talking about tools that you use to grow your primary thing. If you can't stay focused in a company for two years, get, I mean, two years, if at the end of two years, you could take the knowledge that you gained while you were building that and apply it to something that you find more passion in, more 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 uh, power to you. But if you can't stay focused, if you chase the next shiny object, because there's going to be another one coming, there's going to be another one coming, there always is, you're never going to make it. If you can't focus on what you're passionate about, 
you will never, never get to that, that success you're looking for. You can't. It, there's no possible way. You're. It, it's like the devil's playing tricks with you going, oh, look over here. Oh, look over here. Oh, look over here. Oh, look over here. Stay focused. Find something. I'm excited, excited about the fact that I was in World Ventures for three years. Excited about it. Actually, three and a half. I only left in February. And I'm excited because they had one of the greatest training programs for marketing I've ever been part of. They taught me more about event etiquette, how to do, uh, you know, the, the call three-way calls. They taught me all about um, how to run the events, how to, uh, you know, set up the conversation, uh, edification, which has been the greatest thing ever. Edification is the greatest tool you can have. And I don't see people doing it. I don't see people doing it that much at all. Uh, who are you edifying as the expert to help you get the sale? Who are you edifying every single time you set up a presentation, set up a call? Who are you edifying to help you get the sale? There's people out there who have been, been in this thing or in any business. You've been in your business for a year trying to do it on your own, not setting up three-way calls, not working with your, your upline, not working with your team, trying to do it all by yourself, and this is why you're stuck. Things that I didn't learn until my second year. Things I didn't work, learn until my third year. And now I'm the expert. Now I get to give the information. Now people call and set up three-way calls with me, and I love it. I love it love helping people win i i love it that, that's that's the best part if you when you get to the point and you get to help people win that is the best very very best part so guys this is this is a uh a fun day for me hopefully i'll rem i'll remember to look back on this a year from now wondering where i was wondering what was happening um, around this time. So you guys have watched it uh, every day. There's been a Facebook live every single day. You guys have watched this progress. You guys have seen what it takes. You guys have watched the, the content that I put out in the world. You see it. You, you, you're witnessing, you, you're seeing it. I can't, I can't be more transparent. There ain't too many people on this planet that's more transparent than me. What it takes. I give you a guide that gives you step-by-step -step accountable tracking for your progress. I literally want you to win at the level that I've won and, and higher. Because some of y'all are going to have better skills than me. I'm literally not the smartest guy on the planet with this. I just go do it like a bull in a china shop. And that's the reality. So, all that being said, one of my last posts just a few minutes ago, uh, you know, 20 minutes ago, 30 minutes ago, I put a post with a link to get a uh, trip anywhere in our, in our thing. You go pick one, get the email directly to you. Have a nice day. That, that's it. Go, go pick a trip, take it. There's a, uh, activation fee which is the taxes of like 58 bucks and the i think resort fees when you get there but you'd have to pay those anyway so the room is entirely free so go to one of my last posts get your free trip and have a nice day guys i'm curry russell and i appreciate you for uh being on this journey with me talk to you soon